No life. This, you know, this J and B story is the huge story yeah. today. I don't know if, I mean, what do you make of that? I don't know. I mean, you can't speculate what's going on. What I do know about being in the public eye is that you never know the real story and you never will unless somebody decides to share it. Yeah. I think that the fact that they've been so private along is like, it makes people like, oh, it makes people crazy and want to know more. Yeah. I mean, but if you saw a fight on the street right out here, wouldn't you want to know what happened? <laughs> well, you didn't even know that so word famous. True. I'd be like, what happened? What, what did you she think say? she did? Why'd she wall on him like that? That would be, you know, right. I think that's just a natural curiosity. If I saw two girls fighting outside, I'd be like, what? Oh my God. I bet you, I bet you she cheated on it. That she cheated on him with her husband. That's Something happened. so true. Yeah. We're just nosy. <laughs> people are just nosy. And you just got to know that when you're in this business and just roll with the punches. And then I was thinking thinking about I don't know I was in the car thinking about you on the way here and how all these years people have seen you grow and even when you came out how like your butt was a big deal yeah I have then. a song called Big Booty I heard that now that's gonna be that. some Hot 97 that's a Hot 97 yeah. friendly <laughs> song okay tell me about Big Booty Big Booty is a song that I did with Diplo um it's a Diplo track, and I heard it, and I was like, there's no way in the world, and I think I told the story on <laughs> Kimmel, that. that I will ever have a song called Big Booty, because no. like said, it's just, I felt like it would be a joke, you know what I mean? And I didn't want that for this album. This was an important album to me. <laughs> right. I was a serious artist, <laughs> right? And then I was like, <laughs> I played it in the car, because you know, I always, always take what I work on in the studio, and I play it in the car, and I listen to it, and I see what works, and what holds up, and what doesn't. And I played in the car, and my twins were in the car, and they went nuts. They went nuts for the song. And the you minute, were like, it was a first go. listen. The minute it came on, and I was like, I have to put this damn song on the album. So it's going to follow you Yes. Now. <laughs> but it's, you know what? It's a great song. It's a fun song. And again, it's about owning everything about you and who you are and embracing that.